Don't forget, Jonah. I won't, I won't. So, that was where you work? Gee, is it always so much fun? I don't usually punch in in my costumed capacity, Cat. Oh, right. Your silly secret identity. Whoever it is you are under that sexy mask of yours. Well, we've come this far. What next? Aren't you going to show me where you live? Take you home? Sure. You've been to my place. Why shouldn't I see yours? I picture a big web hammock for us to curl up and cuddle in and- Cat, I- Let me think! I- Well, okay. What's the matter, hero? Do it! But it means revealing my secret identity. But we're talking about the black cat. How can you love her and not trust her? I do love her, and, and trust her, I, I, I think. But she loves me as Spider-Man. She doesn't even know Peter Parker. Then it's about time she learned. All right, Cat, I'm ready. Ready, lover? But for what? To open up my entire life to you, lovely lady. To make you privy to my every secret. To take you home. Home? Your home? I mean, where you live? Really? Really? Mm, let's swing like this till sunrise. I'd love to, Cat, but we're home. Home? You live on a rooftop? This is my building, Cat. The entrance to my apartment is through the skylight. Après tu, Mesha? This is where you live? Uh-huh. Rent's cheap. Something wrong? Wrong? Oh, no. It's just that I was expecting... Well, something more along the lines of a spider cave or a fortress of spider tude. Not a bathroom. Hey, I took this place partly because it had a way I could enter and leave as Spider-Man unseen. Only warehouses and factories overlook this rooftop, and they're empty at night. Come on down and drop the skylight behind you. Gotcha. Hardly the Rainbow Bridge, huh? But then my apartment's a far cry from Thor's hollowed halls of Asgard. Still, be it ever so humble, there's no place like home. I don't get it. I, I mean, you're joking, right? Huh? Lover, you're Spider-Man, famous the world over as a fearless fighter of crime. How can a hero like you live here? Here? I have to live somewhere, Felicia. I showed you where I work. This was the only place I could afford on a photojournalist pay. Being Spider-Man hasn't made me rich, you know. Why not? Because that's not what I do it for. Then why are you Spider-Man? Why? I was an orphan, cat. Raised by the best aunt and uncle in the world. Loving me like a son, they gave me all the affection any kid could ever ask for. Only they couldn't give me friends. I was the shy, bookwormish type, taunted and teased all through school. But my interest in science sustained me, gave me a sense of self-worth that my classmates denied me. That interest led one day to a one in a million chance event, to my being bitten by a radioactive spider. The arachnid died, but not before its bite had granted me amazing, fantastic powers. I gained the proportionate strength, speed, and agility of a spider. I could walk up walls, cling to any surface. I had a spider sense which alerted me to danger. I soon donned a costume, created my web fluid, and began to capitalize on my unique powers. In so doing, I forgot that with great power comes great responsibility. Looking out for number one, I let a two-bit burglar whom I could easily have helped capture escape. I did finally catch him several nights later, but not before he'd murdered my Uncle Ben. So I'm not Spider-Man for fame or fortune. I don't do it because the thrill of it all or because I get off on danger. I'm a hero because it's my duty to be one. Because fate one day decided to give a lonely kid this great gift of power. And turn him into Peter Parker, the spectacular Spider-Man. So now you know, Cat. I've never revealed my identity to anyone before. I'm telling you now because I love you. And because from now on, we're going to share our lives together. Sp spider Yes, my darling? Your mask. Please, put your mask back on! Cat, what's the matter? What did I say? I, I, I wanted to share everything with you. I didn't want there to be any secrets between us. I love you. And I love you. 
Spider-Man. Oh, I get it. As Peter Parker, I leave you cold. It's Spider-Man who turns you on. Yes, I mean, who you are, where you live when you're not Spider-Man, all that's unimportant. Wearing that mask, you're my man of mystery. You're the night and excitement and death-defying adventure. Come with me, lover, out into the night, where we can both be who we truly are. Cat! Oh, don't be mad at me, lover. I know I should have leapt up out through the skylight, but that's just not the black cat's style. But if anyone had seen you... They would have been thrilled to find out they had Spider-Man for a neighbor. I trusted you with my secret. And I'll never betray you, lover. If you want to maintain some silly secret identity, I understand. I really do. But let's not let that get in the way of what we've got, hmm? Felicia, how could I stop being who I am? How could I give up being me? Be you. The you I love. My Spider-Man. Leave your other self for the day if you must, but let the night be ours. Holy smokes! Every other woman I've loved, I loved as Peter Parker. The fact that I was Spider-Man always interfered. But the cat loves me as Spidey. I should be ecstatic, right? If I'm gonna be honest, I'd have to admit that it's as Spider-Man that I feel the most free, the most alive. It's Spider-Man I enjoy being the most. It's Spider-Man who's Peter Parker's release from the humdrum world all around. It's Spidey the cat's fascinated with, and why not? After all, isn't my being Peter Parker a drag? Didn't I chuck school because it was wearing me down so I could spend more time in costume? Maybe I was meant to be Spider-Man, and only Spider-Man. Maybe it's something I've always been afraid to consider until her. <laughs> now that's the man I love. A gunshot! And screams from the street below. You stay here, cat. No way. We're past that, remember, lover? We share everything together now. The delight and the danger. There's no time to argue. I can't stop you. But I wish you wouldn't. I've let you risk your life too often. You didn't let me do anything. The black cat does what she pleases. Then join me, but be careful, understand? I understand, Spider. And I'll make you proud of me. Just watch. Just watch! Calm down, cat. We don't know what we'll be facing. 